ready? My empty ass drink. What you finna do? That's it. You gotta pause the music, I'm not trying to get demonetized. Hello, vloggy vlog, welcome back to another video. Happy Tuesday, it is Tuesday. We're starting off the weekly vlog on Tuesday. I actually could have vlogged yesterday, but I just really, I, I needed to enjoy the day, so I didn't vlog. It's Tuesday, the rest of the week is going to be jam-packed. I have a lot of stuff that I need to get done, and I'm trying to be on my A-game. Like, I just announced my new like solidified YouTube upload schedule. So my days when I'm gonna be uploading are Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. I'm gonna always aim for a weekly vlog to go up on Sunday, but if it doesn't happen, then it would be Tuesday. But there's gonna be three videos a week. We gotta do it. I need to hit 100K. Like I'm really trying to be like, I'm, I'm trying to be a real life YouTuber. <laughs> like I'm trying to be a YouTuber. I'm trying to hit 100K before the end of the year. I feel like we can make this happen. Like road to 100K, like, we can do this, so make sure you click the subscribe button down below and you turn on your post notifications. There will be new videos three times a week. They're gonna be really cute and creative and fun and exciting and you guys are gonna enjoy them and I'm gonna enjoy making them for you. And yeah, I just finished the editing a video. It's Tuesday, so there's a video going up. It's currently at 21% uploading to YouTube. I wanna run to the store to grab something before I start the content that I want to film today. So yeah, I need to do that. So that's where we're gonna head to next. Um, tell me why I was sitting outside. I have my camera. Okay, so what I went to go and get off of Santee Alley was not cheaper than it is online and it wasn't even the same price. It was actually more expensive. So I didn't end up getting it. And then I got food. <laughs> Cause you know I had to eat. <laughs> um, so I got a fried chicken shawarma from Dune, Dune LA. So good. This sandwich is so good. I try not to have it often, but oh my God, it is so yummy. It is so, so, so good. I'm outside, I'm about to get this workout in. It's so sunny, like I need some sunglasses. <laughs> I need some shades, cause it's real sunny. I feel like I can't even keep my eyes open, but I'm about to get this workout in. Okay, period. I got every purse, every single shot to my ex I ain't on these niggas, I'll be 
Hey you guys, I just got back from the supermarket actually. I know you guys haven't seen me since way earlier. And my camera's gonna die, great, that's fantastic. I bought a bunch of stuff so that I can have healthy meals throughout the week. As you guys know, if you follow me on Instagram, then you've seen that I've been trying to be really consistent with my fitness journey because summer is right around the corner. I feel like if I dedicate the next three months to eating really healthy, and working out consistently but not like super hard or anything but just consistency with working out and eating healthy i feel like i can snap my body into the shape that i need it to be in you know for summer to pull up i'm trying to really snap this body you know into shape i'm really trying to lick my my absolute best because, you know, like, <laughs> let me do a little haul of everything that I bought from the market so you guys can see what I'm eating on my fitness journey. I'm probably going to be making meals throughout the week during the weekly vlogs. So, if you guys can get that content too, it'll be real cute, you know? So, I got some frozen stuff. First thing I got was this rice cauliflower and a savory herb. And then I got one in roasted garlic. Um, this is a really good substitute for eating rice. I'm gonna be trying to cut down on the carbs. Not like fully cut them out, cause I have like healthy carbs. I'm not following a specific regimen, but I just know there are certain things that I can eat that'll have me feeling really full and energized and I'm able to work out, but they're gonna be like really good for my body as far as not being super high in calorie or fat. And then I got, this lemon pesto veggie with pasta sauce so this is just the vegetables but you can make the vegetables the lemon pesto and then toss them in like um a linguine or like a fettuccine or something so i got that it comes with like all the seasonings and it's just a bag of veggies it has carrots broccoli cauliflower shaped parmesan oh it comes with the linguine noodles and lemon basil pesto sauce period so this would probably be like two meals you know i got reduced fat turkey meatballs i don't know if you guys remember in my earlier vlogs last year when i was when i first moved here i was making a lot of my sauteed kale and turkey meatball meals because those are hella keto but very filling and really good i got a pound of easy peel shrimp from like the little the deli or whatever i got some fruit got bananas for smoothies i got oat milk vanilla oat milk for smoothies and whatnot what else did i get more veggies oh i got some lemon because i want to do lemon water I got a bag of kale, some diced red onion to cook with. I just feel like that would be easier and probably less wasteful on my end. Um, I got tri-colored quinoa. I actually really like quinoa. I got Brussels sprouts. Um, <laughs> I got strawberries. Look at how giant these freaking GMO filled strawberries are. Look at the size of these. Strawberries are not even this big. What is in here? I got grape tomatoes for salad. And then I got a bag of clementines because I love a good clementine in the morning. I love citrusy fruits. And then this bag, this, this reusable bag is literally filled with Essentia waters because they were on sale. The gym in my building opened up this past week. Yeah, the gym opened up. I was able to book my first session for this weekend on Saturday. So I have all my healthy groceries. We're going to be making fun. We're going to be meal prepping, not spending money on, on takeout because I've been eating a lot of takeout. We're going to be eating healthy, eating healthy, and eating out. It's going to be really cute. It's going to be really cute. Yeah, I'm about to put away all these groceries.
heavy taste. What up, bitches? I'm gonna make roasted Brussels sprouts in the oven. They're gonna have a balsamic reduction and pancetta, which is just bacon. But I'm gonna do that. That is Brussels sprout. Yes, look. But look. Like, I took it out the dishwasher and it was like this. There's cracks in this one, like on both sides like if i just like put a little bit of pressure it would split <laughs> i was like what i've preheated the oven I'm gonna wash the brussels sprouts it's time for the percolator why is that stuck in my head <laughs> i got actual cutlery yes i've got cutlery sorry what were you saying no literally Bro, when I tell you I screamed, got my Brussels sprouts, all right, all right. On low heat so that it doesn't burn. This is the balsamic. Thank you. I am gonna cut up this bacon though. This is two slices. Okay, so we got our bacon all chopped up. Take some olive oil. Oh, that was a heavy pour. Black pepper, cracked black pepper on everything. Well, I'm gonna take this pink Himalayan salt. Grab, grab a pinch of this and take some garlic powder and some onion powder. And we'll do a little chili powder. Swast this around. Spruce sprouts in there. And then I'm going to add my bacon. Okay, so to do a balsamic reduction, you basically want to cook it until it's like a thicker, kind of like syrupy consistency because it's very liquidy and light in viscosity, which is why it tastes so good on the Brussels sprouts with the bacon. And then I'm going to open up the shrimp. like a lemon garlic um, herb kind of shrimp. Stealing something? Stealing what? Say it wrong. I remember. Yeah. Look at the color! Oh, I love the song. Look at the color. It's giving garlic butter, sh lemon herb, shrimp. Period. It smells amazing in here. Toss them and then put them back in uncovered so that they can roast. Yes, our Brussels sprouts are definitely roasted Ooh. Ooh. with the big one so we've got the brussels sprouts here all done and roasted with the bacon and then we have the shrimp i'm gonna plate it in my bowl High protein dinner for me. And I have leftovers for tomorrow. Good morning, vloggy vlog. Happy Thursday. It's a Thursday. Okay, come on, come on, come on. 
Who's shysty? That's my dog. But Pooh, you know I'm really shysty. I woke up super early today. I woke up at like 8. Uh, that's early. That is super early. Yeah, I'm not even going to downplay it. That's hella early for me because I'm used to really waking up at like 11, 11.30, 12 o'clock, 1 p.m. <laughs> um, so 8 a.m. is early. I woke up. I had a video that I was already working on for today's upload because my upload days are now Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Sundays. I had some last like final touches to add to it and I realized that there was like a bunch of clips missing out of the, the video and I it was because I had deleted them out of my hard drive and I didn't realize that I was still using those files for the project so now the project has like gaps in it like black spaces so I couldn't finish it and it was kind of sad because it was my birthday um, hair and makeup video that you guys wanted so much and I'm just like <sighs> that was like a whole look the red wig like literally the birthday glam like all of it and the video's messed up now. So I couldn't upload that for today, but I had another video that I was working on that I just needed to like finish up. So I just did my makeup. I could close that video out and that video going up today. It's gonna be on my hair, my natural hair journey, and just, uh, what is this? Six years natural now, five years natural. Um, the bob, you know, the bob is giving. It's really giving. It's giving everything that it needs to give. <laughs> Call from baby daddy. <laughs> I'm making a smoothie. But yeah, I'm just gonna be here sipping my smoothie, editing my video, and then I have emailing to do and stuff. Um, I'll check in with you guys a little later though. Hello, vloogie vlog! Making dinner. I ate the leftovers today for lunch, so I need to make dinner. I'm gonna do cauliflower gnocchi and technique. Chinese went to Target today and bought the um, blow dryer brush thingy that I used in my last video. Cause I'm telling you, that thing is the truth. So I've got the gnocchi. Put olive oil in here and I'm just gonna basically it's frozen my heat is on medium and then I have these turkey meatballs that I got from Ralph's I'm gonna eventually add these to the pan and then I have this spicy tomato basil sauce basil garlic and onion and that's really like that's really it that's how everything look right 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 and then I'm gonna just mix it around got my bowl so that's my cauliflower gnocchi. Oh wait, I'm gonna do some parmesan. Yeah, so this is our low carb pasta. Our cauliflower gnocchi and meatballs. <sighs> oh, that was a real yawn. <laughs> Good morning, vloggy vlog. Happy Friday. Yo, bitches woke up. Well, I've been up for like an hour actually. Um, oh. I washed my face last night and I did my skincare after wearing makeup all day, but I don't know, my face feels like it needs to be cleaned again. Like I need to like, I only cleansed one time yesterday. I feel like I need to double cleanse. I tried implementing some new skincare into my already current routine that I have and my skincare did that weird thing like at the end where it starts to like bead off or peel off or like roll off because the products are not mixing and I need to figure like I need to figure out if it's the order that I'm putting them in um if it's specifically just the new skincare like I don't know what it is but I need to actually call my mom <laughs> my mom would be able to help me no I just had a skincare question Okay. I started using the hyaluronic acid that you gave me, but I started, I, use, I already have a routine, a skincare routine, 
and I was putting it on after two serums that I have uh -huh. and then I put on the moisturizer and then I put on a marula oil to kind of just hold it, seal everything in uh -huh. and at the end when I put the marula oil on I feel product like beating off of my face like you know where does that rolly thing like they're not mixing yeah it's like so I'm trying to figure out if it's I think it's a hyaluronic acid because I mean, it, my routine without it wasn't doing that, but I want to be able to use it in the routine because it makes my skin look so hydrated. So the, so the hyaluronic, maybe you should put it first. Okay. And make sure your face is a little damp when you put it on. Oh, okay. A little damp, and then put that on, and then put on your other serums and everything else. Okay, and then moisturizer, and then oil. Uh-huh. Okay, I'm going to do that now. I was just And wondering. do a little bit. Do don't you know? Don't use a lot. Yeah, just a little bit, mm -hmm. like a dime-sized amount. No, that's too much. Oh. Pea-sized amount. Oh. Okay. Like a little green pea. Okay. Okay. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Uh, I stay waking this lady up. She said I'm using too much hyaluronic, but like I like to be moisturized. I like to feel moisturized. I just my bathroom looks so hectic. Like this is my setup here. So I still got that set up. The wires. I just put away the um the flat iron and the blow dryer brush I had it out from yesterday. Let's do some skincare. I was showing Chiny on FaceTime and she was making fun of me. She said I look like a boxer. <laughs> I did though. I look like I was on Money Mayweather's team. I was like but yeah, this robe is from Savage X Fenty. Not sponsored, but hopefully they see this and they want to sponsor a video. Bought this and I bought some lingerie and I'm planning on doing a look with the lingerie. It's gonna be very cute. Um, but that's a surprise, you know. But yeah, I bought this robe. It's like a cotton material, but it's really stretchy. It's like a, a jersey, kind of jersey knit. Good morning, baby. Good morning, bye-bye you doing so i wash my hands now i need to cleanse let's do an exfoliator this is from tula skincare um this is a sugar a sugar scrub i love this exfoliator because i have sensitive skin but i also have dry skin and exfoliators can be very drying and this one does not dry my face out at all so i still get to feel like I'm exfoliating away texture, but it's still moisturizing. Like, it's amazing, it's it's so good, so good. Just watch, just watch. So, warm water, wet my face. And then I take some of this. And I just work it into my skin. I always ex look like take the exfoliator and scrub my brows because do you ever get those little, little pimples in your eyebrows and they're so painful? I be getting those like here and there. Okay, and now you want to wash it off. Look at my... I'm vlogging. My skin, all of the sugar like completely melts into your skin. So it smells really sweet. It kind of tastes sweet too because you know, if you get on your lips. And it's just like really moisturizing. All right, so I washed it off and then I took a little q-tip and I'm like cleaning up the makeup That's along my lash line. My face feels really clean, right? But I still want to do another cleanser. I want to double cleanse in order to double cleanse You want to use a cleanser that's not exfoliating for the second one more of like a You can use like a gel based cleanser if you're more oily or you can use a cream or milk based cleanser if you're more dry I'm gonna use a milk based cleanser this is the chamomile cleansing milk from natural naturopathica i love this cleanser so much it actually like it's pretty much done <laughs> so i have a second one here that's like full and i just am sitting it sits here and i watch it every day and i wait for this one to be done so i can open that one <laughs> so i'm gonna wet my face again and then she might be done i got my cleanser and this one, I just put over everything, like I, I scrub my eyes with it everywhere because it doesn't actually like 
blurring or anything. And it just has the softest chamomile scent. It smells so good and so like clean and I love how this makes my skin feel too because it's very hydrating. And especially since moving to California, my skin has gotten so dry. The air here is way drier. My hair is drier. My skin is drier. The skincare gotta be on 10, you know? Not an emergency in my building. What the hell? <sighs> Ciao. Washed off. I just pat dry. Oh! Right in the middle of my skincare routine. Okay, come on, let's go. You guys, tell me how by the time I went downstairs, by the time I got, oh, look at how I went outside, by the way. Look at this. <laughs> by the time I went downstairs, the alarm stopped going off, and I was like, do I still even have to go outside? Like, they done turned off the alarm, but I still went. And I got me some Starbucks. So. BRB for the um, skincare routine because I'm about to eat my Starbucks. I'm too freaking hungry right now. So my drink that I, one of my drinks that I get from Starbucks now is that new one, the iced brown sugar oat milk shaken espresso. This is very good. It's very good. It's really good. It's yummy. It's so good. And then they have a chocolate almond milk one. That one sounds amazing, but like I haven't even tried. I was like, if I'm gonna be outside, I might as well be fed. If I'm gonna be a bad bitch, I might as well eat, right? If I'm gonna be walking around here blinking, I might as well eat. Right? If I'm, if I'm gonna be around here breathing, I might as well eat. Okay, so I completely finished um, organizing my closet. I cleaned up my entire apartment, basically. Living, living space is looking real, real clean, real organized. All the junk is put away, all the boxes. I got this stuff that I need to unbox. Yeah, let's just get to it, cause I bought some really cute stuff. Some of it is stuff that was sent to me, some of it is stuff that I bought. I got my waist trainer on. So, you know, the breathing is limited. Um, and I'm drinking this Bolt House Farms Daily Greens. It has two and a half, no, two fifths cup kale, spinach, and romaine per bottle. This one is not the sweet one. This is, I thought it was the sweet one. This is like the vegetable one. Like, it's straight vegetables. <laughs> but it's, it's not hard to drink. It's just, it literally smells like celery. Oh, it smells like celery too. But yeah. Girl, we trying to be skinny. We trying to be skinny, trying to be healthy. <laughs> okay, period. Let's start with the Ipsy. Let's let's do our Ipsy box. So this is my monthly Ipsy, my some um, Super Glam Bag Plus. <laughs> I be saying literally anything when I, I call this anything that they send me every month. You guys have seen this. We all love this. I always like end up discovering a new product in my ipsy glam bag that i didn't know existed that i actually fall in love with there's always at least one but for march it's stronger together equality you know march was women's month the inside of the box with all this stuff Ooh, are you gonna focus oh look at the little bag with the, the minis and it. it has women on it oh so in here we've got some goodies sila c to skin scrub natural grain polish is this an exfoliating moisturizer Ooh, there's a mini translucent kat von d powder in here a liquid eyeliner from araceli 
and then a mini highlighter um those all came in the mini bag and then ooh, i love refreshments now i'm like such a fan of refreshments they sent me the body cream and the hand cream and i used all of them they sent me the razors and the and the shaving gel and i love the shaving gel and now they sent a deodorant and a body wash oh my god oh there's two deodorants one is lavender splash and the other one's unscented love that they really be sending your girl brushes the next items are things that i purchased these are amazon purchases what's in here oh i know what this is girl this is what i went down to santi alley for earlier this week and the girl the lady was trying to sell it to me but too much money and i was like honey i can get this on amazon i was just trying to get it today and she was like well then order on amazon and i was like well then i will i got me another um lash lift kit from icon sign this is an eyelash perming kit right but i have a video on youtube it has like i think it has like 200,000 views now i use this on my eyebrows it wasn't i wasn't the first person to come up with it but um i did a whole tutorial on how i basically uh, laminate my brows per my brows so that they lay flat and they look really full they look so cute i needed to buy a new one because the one i bought last year which was the first one that i bought finally ran out like a whole year later um so i had to re-up on that the next thing i got ooh, i'm excited about this i'm gonna wear these tomorrow <laughs> I got those um, leggings that everyone was talking about on uh, TikTok, those TikTok leggings, you know, the ones that Jordan Woods tried on and everybody with the butt and it got the, the scrunch up the, up the butt crack. I got those and I got them in this really obnoxious color because I'm that annoying. Oh, and they got the booty crack. Look at the booty. Look at the booty. Yeah, these are gonna be real cute. I'm gonna wear these tomorrow at the gym. When I go to the gym. And when I tell you Amazon gets all my money, Jeff Bezos, he a trillionaire because of me. Okay, point blank period. Like, it's ridiculous at this point. Aha, okay. So I bought some nail stuff. This is a McCart gel polish kit. I do have an affiliate code with McCart. So if you want to shop this on Amazon, I'll have the link down below. Or if you want 20% off of McCart's, McCart's website. I just needed it like right now and they have two day shipping on Amazon. But if you want 20% off of anything off of McCart's website, use code Jasmine and you'll get 20% off. I have it on the screen and in the description box down below. But I got some gel polish colors, so freaking cute. These are all like pastels. The set I have in mind that I'm going to do with this is going to be so freaking cute. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait. Uh -huh. Okay, so those are all my Amazon purchases, right? But then, I'm gonna show you guys, even though I said I wasn't, I'm gonna show you what I got from Savage X Fenty. Um, I just bought one bra and panty set just to try it. Like, I wasn't sure. I didn't want to, like, splurge or anything because I'm not really, like, a bra person anymore. I wear a lot of bralettes, um, and they have those on there, but a lot of the ones that I like, they didn't have in my size, and it was because I was shopping pretty late in the month. Um, I feel like they sell out of all the cute stuff right at the beginning of the month because every month they do, like, new drops or whatever. This was, like, really, like, the only matching bra and panty set that they had in my sizes so i was able to get it so i got that and then i got the the savage x fenty robe which i showed you guys earlier that i'm absolutely obsessed with i've literally worn it every single day anyway oh this is so cute though this really might make me want to start wearing bras <laughs> not gonna lie i got this really cute lavender lacy um underwire bra and then I got the matching. The panty I got is the Laced Cheeky with medallion. Isn't that so cute? It has the Savage X Fenty medallion right there at the top of the butt crack. These is gonna be so cute. Well, they look kind of big. Maybe I should have got a small. I got them in a medium. They look kind of big. All my panties are smaller than this. I think maybe they'll shrink a little bit in the wash. These are really cute. Oh my gosh, I love this. I thought this was so cute, the medallion. And then the last thing that's literally been sitting on my floor for way too long, and I know you guys have seen it in the background of my videos, <laughs> is the stuff I bought from Ikea like a month ago. So we're gonna do, ooh, we're gonna do a huge 
decor haul right now. Let me get it. It's like it tastes good, but it also doesn't. <laughs> okay, so what should I start off with? Oh, I got so much stuff. I did get um Tupperwares and I already opened them. <laughs> But it's this set of Tupperware. Um, the next thing I got was a pack of two extension cords. I got some more tea light candles. You guys know I love these candles. I have a bunch of the little um, IKEA tea light holders all over my apartment. I have them on the windowsill. I have them by the TV. I have them on the table. I have some in the bathroom. So I love these. Um, I try to get different scents every time. This one's apricot and this one's vanilla. It's vanilla ice cream actually because there's literally an ice cream. And then this one has apricots on it. But I got two of these. Dang, I only got two. I feel like I normally get more than that. But I already have like four of them in my cabinet over here where I keep all my candles stuff. So. Um, so I got that. And then I also, oh, these are cute. I forgot I got these. I got a tall pack of the wax candle sticks. I don't know if these are scented. I feel like they're not. Cause if, I feel like it would say, but I got these because I got, these so these are um candle holders but they're black and i low-key oh i want to spray paint them gold like the brassy color that i have in the rest of my apartment but then i also have some slight like black accents like my lamp my lamps and then my tv of course so i'm like maybe i should keep them black because it would still tie into the decor but i so i haven't decided but yeah, there's three um, candle holders in here. And then I got the tall candles to sit in them. So that would be cute for like when I cook dinner and I want it to be like really, you know, a vibe and very sexy and cute for Bay. Like just, you know, set those up. Or for myself, shit, I'd be cooking for myself. I'd really be throwing down for myself and putting the candles on and setting the mood and putting music on. And it'd really just be a whole vibe in here just for me. Like, I love that. I love that. <laughs> um, man, what else did I get? Oh, to stay on trend, <laughs> I got um, one of these like large candles. I don't know why I just got one though. Why did I just get one? Honestly, my thought process like a month ago, I don't really know where my head was at, but um, yeah. So I just got one of these. I think I'm gonna sit it in one of the glass cylinders that i have sitting next to the tv i feel like that's what i was gonna do then i got a mini um wooden cutting board i want to use this uh for like a charcuterie plate for like a mini one and then because i'm obsessed i got some more um little tea light holders candle holders um but these are a different design they're like they have the textured what is this engraving i don't know but they're very cute. Like these are so cute. They're like mini compared to to these that I have. Different vibe. It gives off a different vibe. I really like them though. And you can put candles. So I got one, two, three of those. And then I got just a pack of um these cork board trays for like when you have um a hot pot or pan and you don't want to set it down on your counter you have one of these on the counter you put it on top giant mason jars i feel like that's what you would call this right when it's like this is this a mason jar or is it something else i got different sizes i got two i got two actually that are the same size i want to do um flour and sugar um and then get like little designated ladles to sit inside of it as well oh here's my long ass receipt too Yeah, so I'm gonna do I'm gonna do flour and sugar in the big one and then I forgot what I was gonna put in the smaller one <laughs> what was I gonna put in here I have no idea I'm gonna I'm put something in it though but I got the smaller size but yeah that's all the stuff that I got from Ikea uh -huh. that's all the stuff that I've accumulated probably all of this other stuff that I got was more recent but the Ikea stuff was literally like a month ago today 
of all days was really giving like spring cleaning like when you wake up and it's like it's spring it's time to clean like get rid of all the junk i put my christmas decorations that was sitting in the corner up like i took them down but they were sitting in the corner just collecting dust i put those up like organized my closet my closet was crazy i had boxes in there from when i moved here that i was taking care of today of all days like it was just giving that vibe though like yeah it's a spring clean kind of day but yeah so i'll see you guys um in a little minute you know a little bit later hey you guys so oh let me turn the fan off um i just got out the shower i'm doing a maintenance kind of evening i'm gonna be waxing my face my upper lip and my eyebrows and then my armpits because honey is tum and then i'm going to do my brow lamination because it's also time for that <laughs> period and i'm gonna do my toes i already started on the toes because i wanted to get all the dead skin and the cuticle off as soon as i got off the shower <laughs> last night right and then mona crazy ass called me up at 8 a.m talking about some get up we about to go outside like do why i just did my toes because she woke me up at 8 a.m and i was like i'm not going back to sleep now so i didn't do my toes last night because it was kind of late when i finished all the other maintenance like the waxing and the brow lamination i was tired and i watched this really corny movie on netflix like i did not like it it was deadly illusions i would not re recommend watching that if you if you watched it let me know what you thought of it down below but i was just like yes i just my toes they look so freaking good hold on look at my toes i went with a french this time you guys know i always do freaking white toes i love my white toes but I really wanted to try doing French and I think they came out so cute. I have a gym session at 12 o'clock that I was able to reserve. So I'm gonna have a really nice work for my gym workout! I'm so We got a gym workout later and I'm so excited I'm like, oh my god. It's gonna be really good. Okay, period. So I'll see you guys in a bit. You guys, guess who got a smoothie? I went and I got a protein shake before my workout um, because I didn't eat anything and I want to have energy and I made sure to get one that had protein powder in it. It tastes so yummy. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm about to go work out. Let's get this workout in. See you at the gym.
guys. So I went and I worked out, right? Skinny. I came back and I did my, I took a shower, I blow dried my hair, no straightener, just blow dryer. Very voluminous. I'm out with Mona. Wait, wait, the vlog has to say hi to Mona. You were actually in last week's weekly vlog. I was? Yes, it was the vlog from when we went out to WeHo. That was like that old ass vlog that I was sitting on. But I posted it last week as last week's vlog. So let's see you again. Um, we're at Prank Bar in DTLA. We're gonna get some drinks and whatnot. Okay. And then we're gonna go shopping. It's gonna be very fun and do other stuff and just be outside because uh, it's a hot girl motherfucking summer. It's a city girl summer. Period. It's a hot girl summer. Excuse me, sir. It's a hot girl summer. <laughs> Wait, we need a boomerang. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> this bitch <laughs> finished her fucking margarita and I'm still like halfway and I'm like dang I didn't realize you finished your drink she said bitch I'm a water side <laughs> what like what is what is she actually talking about she's no you mad no you about to eat the um thing with the <laughs> no <laughs> no the sun is on you look at the sun <gasps> What's going on? Mm -hmm. Not them fighting at the light. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> you want a video or a boomerang? Both of them. Yeah, let's do the video first. What you want me to do? Whatever you want. You're so cute. Oh my god. Mona. 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 Why are you so fucking cute? Period. No, it's literally you for me. Boomerang it. Okay, ready? My empty ass drink. What you finna do? That's it. <gasps> what? You. <laughs> it was off guard, but it was literally perfect. <gasps> Lamb, it's the skin, it's the fucking ponytail, it's it's all of it. Literally all of the melanin. Your skin is glowing. You're literally glowing. Not alright, alright. Is it awesome? Something go away. I need to get your picture. But why is it shining, shining, shining? Yeah, it's literally shining. It's really. She's just as jokey. Oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Switch, switch. Do, 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 do. <laughs> we funny as shit for doing this though. I'm doing a couple portraits. Oh my, oh my. It's really fucking giving. It's me not getting his bald ass. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Look at all of our food we got laid out here. I didn't even show you guys, but I ordered a Moscow Mule. Um, it was so good. Literally, do the Moscow Mule. Don't do the margarita. Do the Moscow Mule. I'm like, come and put that pussy on me. Don't be running for me. <laughs> 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 we ordered tea. <laughs> tea and, and tart and tiramisu. We're at the Grove. We just We're got here. Look at Mona. Hi. We're watching a dog show. We're watching a dog show. As we have perfect tea and tiramisu and, and strawberry tarts. And Mona looking beautiful as always. And I think Jasmine I'm gonna go into looking stunning as always. <laughs> I'm gonna go into um, Nordstrom after this. Do you see her hair blowing in the wind? We got our chai tea. Chai tea tart. Mona saying a little prayer. <laughs> Hello, vlogy vlog. Happy Sunday. It's the last day of the vlog. Um, yesterday my camera died when I was out with Mona. 
that but it was so cute like we went we did so much stuff yesterday and we were just like really just trying to enjoy the day in each other's company because it's been a little minute since i've seen her i know y'all just seen her but it's been a couple it's been it's been some time for me so yeah yesterday was really cute it's uh about 1 30 right now i have a gym session booked for two um, I've been up since like 8.30 though, um, editing video, editing today's weekly vlog actually. I went to get Starbucks earlier. Tell me why the drink that I always get, the brown sugar oat milk drink, the new one, it was completely sold out. They were like, yeah, this drink is really popular. And it was like 12 when I went. And I'm like, you guys don't even open up super early on Sunday, so that's crazy. Like, what? <laughs> what y'all mean y'all sold out for the day? Um, but I'm about to get up, put on my gym clothes, and then I think I'm gonna make a protein shake so I can drink some of it before I go down there. I have like some energy, but I need like food energy. Yeah, let's get up and get dressed. Period. Okay, got my workout clothes on. I think I'm gonna do no shirt today. Today's gonna be back and upper body. And I know I said I was gonna make the smoothie now, but like, it's only 10 minutes. I mean, I can do it really quickly. Okay, let's do it really quickly. I'm trying to I'm going to do this um, Kroger Nutella. This is Rihanna shit. The protein powder I bought is Orgain. Um, it's vegan. And this is uh, the superfood one. So it's like a meal replacement too. very good but it's very sweet <laughs> oh but it's so good I'm trying to drink like half so when I come back up to only have half left to drink this is really gonna make me mad thick <laughs> got my water my headphones I need to get some uh, wireless headphones because my airpods are no good anymore but I'm about to go downstairs to do this workout I'm not gonna vlog I'm gonna leave my camera up here today I just want to get this workout in really quickly and get back upstairs so I can finish my work um <laughs> but I'm gonna go work out Damn, I'm tired. I literally just walked in the house. Look at all the sweat. Oh, I had to keep my mask on the whole time I was working out because there was somebody else in there. And I was like, I don't know. You know, you got to keep me in squad. Damn, I'm hot. I drink. Ooh. Oh, my God. I'm so tired. But that was such a good workout. Ooh. Yeah. <sighs> it really... It really be like taking off um, your bra. When you take off your waist trainer. It is the most beautiful day outside. Like it's so, it's like 86 degrees. It's so hot that the air is like still. Like there's no breeze. I low key want to go on the roof and sunbathe, but I also have this video to finish. I'm gonna see how quickly I can get it done so I can go sit out in the sun, maybe get a tan. <laughs> I'm gonna see you guys in a bit. Hopefully I'll be like in the sun getting a tan. <laughs>